Hello. Oh, this is my uh, 1959 Etzel I have just bought at this junkyard. Sorry, this is a new camera, so it's kind of hopefully it'll work out. I'm not really kind of used to it just yet, y'all. But yeah, I wanted to uh, put this, show y'all this car I bought. And a lot of y'all know that Etzels weren't made very long. And this one is a 223 with a three-speed on the column car. And it's a Ranger. But it's not really too bad. But it's got some spots in it. But I'm going to restore it. But I purchased it a few days ago. See if we can get shots in the interior. I gotta be careful because there's a snake in here. I believe last time I was here. But this car, you can tell, it's kind of been in here for a while. All right. Now I believe this car is the original miles car. I believe the 65,000 miles is correct. If I can get a shot of the miles. Horn rings right over there. But and I registered this car on the internet for the Etzel.com website. But wait right now I'm waiting on uh getting a title for this car. Let's see if we can go to the pasture side. But basically what I like to do is I like to buy these cars. Well, uh, these Etzels, and uh, try and get them running. I already own a 58 that y'all see a little bit later. Hopefully y'all can see the interior kind of good. But the floor pans are not really in that bad shape. And the horn ring. More than two. See y'all the back of the car. That's all. And this car has set since 1978, I believe, if that's right. October 1978. But they've got quite a few bit of cars here. And drugs. This car's been here for a good while. I'm not sure how long it actually has been in here, but it's for a while. Let me show y'all the back of the car. Y'all kind of had to bear with me. I have to kind of go around some of these cars. Kinda in here. Let's see. Get a shot of the back of the car. <laughs> I actually got a tree. You're running right up next to the bumper. But these are in real good shape. I was looking at those the other day and these will polish up real nice. I don't know where a rowel or how you say it is. But this car is pretty much here. I don't know if y'all can see the underneath that in the night. Let's see, get a shot from the back of it. The sun's kind of messing it up. But I love these Etzels and they're uh, hard to find as y'all know but I've always wanted a 59 and I've been looking for one since I was about 12 and I finally found this one and I was like 
okay, I'm gonna try and get it. And I saved for about a year and I finally got it. But if I could, I would get the hood open for y'all. But I can't reach. I can't, <laughs> my fingers are too short to push the hood lights open. It's really not that bad shape, really. I think most of it will clean up when I start doing the body work on it. All the glasses in good shape, pretty much. Kind of on the ground, I know that's one thing that's not really All that, it'll polish up real nice. But, I wanted to show y'all this car before I bring it home. Hopefully I can get a title for it, and if I can, I'll end up getting a refund. But, I hopefully I can get a title. I should get a title for it. I'm hoping, because this is my dream car. I'll show y'all around a little bit. Bye bye, Ethel. Where you'll be coming home. I think it's. I'm not sure what these cars are. Old Chevrolet. Wish I could figure out to zoom, y'all. I'm sorry about that. Old Oldsmobile, Rambler. Plymouth. This is the old section of the junkyard. I'm not sure if that's a Hudson or not. Maybe y'all can tell me some of those cars. Don't. I think it's a duster or something. It's a light truck. Um, I think it's a Chevrolet too. GMC. Oh, Buick. Mustang. There's some cars around here. That's another old Chevrolet. I guess they're a C10, I believe. I'm not sure if that's correct. Sorry, y'all, if it's not. <laughs> they recently put this car back here. Oh, another Chevrolet. I'm not sure if any of these cars are for sale, y'all. I'm sure they are. But there's a holy cow, there's a boat back here. <laughs> 390 GT. Oh, let's see, what kind of car is this? I know it's a Ford. This is, I guess, a fair lane. I don't know. It's been sitting since like '84.
It's got no block in it. Thank y'all for watching, and uh, hopefully everything will work out, and I'll get the title for the car, and I'll start making uh, some more uh, videos of the Etzels on YouTube. Thank you.